While the UN squares off with advancing rebel units around Freetown, the civilian exodus has already begun. Thousands of refugees are pouring from the nearby towns of Waterloo and Masiaka, where UN peacekeepers were defeated by suspected rebel groups. This is only the latest outbreak of violence in Sierra Leone's long-running civil war. Many refugees still bear the scars of past battles. But making the trek to Freetown is no guarantee of safety. Here, tension is rising following the disappearance of rebel leader Fode Sanko. And with news of the UN defeated Masiaka, the peacekeeping operation is increasingly under attack, not least from the locals themselves. United Nations are biased. They are totally biased. They treat Africans like a dog. They are doing, in fact, Africa because we are, we are black, they don't want to seek our interest. Seeking to prop up UN credibility, British troops continue stop and search operations on vehicles along the road to Sierra Leone's airport outside Freetown. They'll shortly be joined by 800 more UN troops from Bangladesh. So far, the British government is ruling out putting its troops into combat. But with no end to the crisis in sight, observers say the purpose of the mission could soon change.